Hi everyone, I'm Ethan Corby, the North American Product Manager for Nordica, and here we're going to talk about how to size a ski. It's one of the most common questions that comes through our website through calls into customer service, so we thought it'd be a great idea to walk through a simple video for you guys to watch to be able to better understand how to size a ski for yourself. So one of the things that you need to answer for yourself and probably for a shop employee when you walk into the store is what type of skiing do you like to do? Do you like to be a little bit more on trail or do you like to be a little bit more off trail? Also to be honest about your ability level when you go in and you start shopping for a ski or start having a conversation with a shop employee. And then third, the frequency of which you ski is also very important. That'll give the shop employee and yourself some parameters to understand at what level you should be. This is all important information when you start looking at how to size a ski properly. So I've got Allie here and I just happen to know that Allie is an incredible skier. So we're going to be looking for something that's a little bit longer. Typically you look for something from your chin all the way up to your top of your head or even above if you're a really elite level skier. You're looking for something right around the bridge of your nose for the optimal length. So if I didn't know Allie was necessarily as good of a skier as she would, I'd probably be grabbing this Wild Bell in a 162. That falls, again, right around that bridge of that nose. That's optimal length uh, for Allie. But knowing that Allie puts a lot of days on snow a year, she likes to ski out west, and she has a lot of experience on snow, I'd probably go with something a little bit longer in that 172. When you go in that little longer of a ski, you get more edge stability. The ski holds together at some higher rates of speed, can handle a little bit more. When you go into a little bit shorter ski, it's easier to throw around. It's a little bit more maneuverable. So if it's something that you would like to enjoy to do, so some shorter turns on snow, or you're just entering into the sport, tend to go on a little bit of the shorter side of things. Thank you very much for tuning in, and I hope this video allowed you to better choose a ski size that's correct for you.